This weekend was hot. We all felt it. You, you may remember last year, the city of Jacksonville and University of North Florida teamed up for an urban heat study, creating a heat map of the hottest places here in Jacksonville. So what are we going to do with all these findings? Huh? Science is right there. Renata De Gregorio on your side asking those very questions. Hello, Renata. Good morning. The information from the study is being used for the city to create a plan to alleviate heat stress, according to the UNF professor involved. It can also be used by you right now. You can put in your address to see how great the risk of heat stress is where you live. There are also several things you may notice looking at the urban heat map. The downtown core here is incredibly hot. University of North Florida professor Adam Rosenblatt shows us the results of the urban heat study by UNF in the city of Jacksonville. St. John's Town Center is about 10 degrees hotter than these areas that are more forested over towards the east. And if we zoom in on it, you can see why because it's just solid parking lots. So what do we do with this information? Rosenblatt says the city's chief resilience officer is making a plan. The plan will include steps for how to alleviate heat stress throughout the city. These things involve increasing the amount of trees that are planted. We need to make it um, mandatory that if you're developing a residential neighborhood or developing a new shopping center, you have to have a certain amount of tree cover and you need to decrease the amount of parking lots and asphalt. Rosenblatt says trees aren't the only answer, but they are the most obvious. One thing you may notice on the heat map, some of the lower income areas are the hottest. There are certain parts of the city, especially on the north side, where um, there are low, low income communities that are exposed to extreme heat, um, whereas wealthier communities are not as prone to that. He encourages you to look up your address on the heat map and talk to your city council representative about what's being done to alleviate heat stress in your neighborhood. What do you need to be aware of with the heat and what can you do to try to help relieve it? We'll talk about that coming up in the next half hour. Find the heat map link on firstcoastnews.com. Renata DiGregorio, First Coast News, on your side.